Monkey. Okay guys, so I'm getting ready to head out, but I get a text message from Orange Street Audubon. Good morning, Emily. This is Haley from OTF Audubon. Reaching out to let you know that you will be starting at floor station three this morning. Check-in will begin at 9.55. Please come to the door at this time for a temperature and symptom check. See you soon. What's up bitches and welcome back to my channel. I'm heading off to Orange Street Fitness Audubon. I haven't been there in like over seven months because of everything going on with the pandemic. I'm taking class with Coach Ovi, who is an OG Orange Street Fitness coach. I don't know exactly how many years he's been around. He actually used to coach out in Newark, Delaware. I've wanted to take his class, but you know, I live in Philadelphia and although Newark is not that far, it's just I haven't had the time between working and everything to just travel all the way there to a time that he coaches class. But now he's working at one of my favorite studios. Even when I posted on Instagram story that I was taking his class, a handful of people from the Newark Delaware studio messaged me saying like, oh my gosh, I miss him. Like, you're gonna have so much fun. Like, or I'm jealous. Another thing that is super important to today's video is the link. Okay, so I have the Apple Watch and I'm into it. I use this free app Zones that kind of curates a chart that looks like orange cherry, but I'll be honest with you. I took class without it and I just do not like not being able to see my thing on the screen. Like, in what world did I think I would be okay with that? I am going to talk to the staff today to see if I can pre-order or if they have them in the studio That would be ideal and the reason I want to get the link is because I already have the Apple watch and I feel like it's the newest Technology, so why not try that out? It's the perfect thing You know, I want to wear my Apple watch But I want to be able to see my chart and my orange Siri stats like up on the screen And then also I forgot if I don't wear an orange Siri fitness heart rate monitor literally none of my stats will be tracked into my little app Yeah, so um, I definitely am getting I'm getting the link stat. So we're figuring that we're sorting that out today you're sorting that out today, period. Please comment below if you do have the link. Let's get into the video. It's Friday, Junior. I have PTO today. Mm, mm. What you know about that? That's right. Period, period, mommy. It's gonna be a good day. Okay, so we officially just pulled up at Orange Street Audubon. I have my clean mask ready to go. Their check-in is like five minutes before the class starts, but I like really have to pee because I just drove like a half hour, so. I also don't know, like, can I bring a bag in? Like, I don't really even know. Every studio I feel like might be different. Also, I don't know if this is a 2G or 3G. I didn't look, but it's gonna be bad. I guess to minimize objects, I'm gonna take my jacket off. Freezing butt. This is killing. Cool. I have to pee so bad. I've been sat for another four more minutes, and I know if I just stand out there, I'm just gonna be standing there. I mean, I don't know. Maybe they let me in, but like, follow the rules. They said check in time was 9.55. How's it going? I'm back. How you doing? I'm doing good. All right, so I'm gonna get your temperature first. All right. Go. All right, time to step into the COVID. Experience any of these? No, I'm Been good. Out state. Not yet. All right, so you got your text already? Yes, I did. So that's going to be your station. You can grab a baggie or your purse. If that can't fit in your cubby, you're going to put it out. Okay. But your cubby matches up to your number. You grab your baggie and then you can see Haley. Hi. Good, how are you? Good, thanks. Can I just grab a picture for your profile? Yes. So I had to run my purse out to my car. To put everything in this little baggie. Whatever. All over the bed. Oh, me. Yes, I'm ready, so I'm ready. <laughs> yes. I'm, put that right in here. I'm excited. I'm me too. Okay, so number three, I guess.
Cody, and he has been coaching for Orange Theory for four years. And what's your favorite thing about being an Orange Theory coach? I don't even know where to begin. The favorite part of OTF to me, I guess, would be the members. It's fun, it's exciting, right? The workout always changes, so that's fun. But the members, like everybody pushes themselves, but together. Uh -huh. So like if someone's, you know, having a hard time on the treadmills, the rowers will push them. If the rowers are having a hard time, the floor will help, so on and so forth. Everybody works okay. together. Yeah, we have different goals, but at the end of the day, we're all here for very similar reasons. Mm -hmm. right? And that's to get better. So it's awesome that we can do this together and help each other as we go through. Nice. What are your thoughts on starting on the treads or the rowers? So depending on your goals, you always want to think of where you want to start. Now, in a perfect world, you would switch it up. Not always will you start on the rower, the treads, or the floor. But my personal experience and everything we've done here together, I would recommend either starting on the rower or the floor first. So the treadmills will technically be your last block. Based on goals, if you want to lift a little heavier, burn a little bit more fat, you want to do the floor or the rower first so you're not exhausted coming off the treads and then off the rower and then you go to the floor because we're not going to lift as heavy right. or, because we're already tired. Right. So if I had a best thing to say, I would always switch it up. But if I don't have a premier membership or if, I have, if I'm limited, then I would always try to start either on the rower or the floor. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because I feel like I can always keep pushing myself yes. on the tread. Right. Because you're like changing the numbers, but yeah. then if you're on the floor, like your pace and tempo yeah. might be slower if you're tired. Because you're not going to lift the 70 pound dumbbell off the inclines and the rower, right? right? But you may do it when you're fresh. When you just got in here, you're ready to go, you're excited, right? You're going to lift a little heavier at that point than after the treadmills with all the all outs. Yeah. The inclines today, then the pushes, right? So a lot on the legs. Yeah. So, awesome. Yes, ma'am. I was going to talk to Ty about the link. All right. So the link right here. New and approved nice small tiny box because you have a nice small tiny heart rate monitor you need an apple watch for this to work here is the link so it clicks on the band and so you don't have to worry about it sliding up down the arm you have to worry about being uncomfortable and then it reads everything that you do as you do normally in class so you see all your your stats all your performance at real time it has a nice charging box that goes along with it that can last for a few hours there again it's for more comfortability get your results in real time it also works with your daily app so oh, you're okay. going to see that nice circle that you guys work for and broke yeah. for. It all oh, comes okay. into place. So it's not like you're getting two different numbers, cool. two different graphs. You're going to get the same thing. Okay, so it sounds like the stats are going to go towards both your Apple Watch stats mm -hmm. and it'll get recorded in the Orange Sherry Fitness OTB app and everything. Yep. Cool. Yeah, so okay. having two separate. So your normal heart monitors right now, they register your heartbeat every second. These are going to register your heartbeat every five seconds. So you're not going to see a constant climb. You're going to see you're at 73. And then once you go to that push, you might stay at 73 and then you'll see your jump to 84 and it's not that the heart monitor is messed up it's just every five seconds going to read you so it's going to keep you more at a steady state that you'll see how you're working as you go in your intervals um so that's all your difference there that makes sense so you're not freaking out yeah that. yeah so studio studio there are other studios um that are already they're fully functioning and they're they're running it ours are on pre-sale uh, our expected date is the 26th to receive them but with covid everything oh, okay. so it's not totally guaranteed 129, 129 okay resale. every studio gets like limited quality yeah so it's just first come first serve cool so could I place a pre-order and then like I would just come pick it up at the studio? Yes. Cool. So then I guess you'll you'll just notify me when it's in and I'll come yeah. get it. Yeah, cool. you know when you're in. Oh look at your picture today. Oh wait, can I see oh, it? Say, I'm not gonna see it. Because I, I was so excited. I was literally saying the other day, like I wish. Wait, will this be new everywhere across the board? Oh just here. Yeah, I guess. Is there, there a way to change it on the app? Do I have to go to the home studio for that? Oh, no. <laughs> it's not like it matters. In the books. So Betty's about to get to do and approve. Yes. Link. Yes, you already no. know. You heard it here first in the vlog. Can you only use the link inside the Orange Jury Studio? You can use it anywhere. Oh. Just like, so when you're outside, you're running, moving and grooving. You skateboarding, rollerblading. Oh. That's your thing. I'm oh, gonna be rollerblading. yes. You can use it there. This is so exciting. We got big things coming. I'm excited for this. This is this is about to be a moment. We got Coach Ovi putting in that work, keeping it clean. Thing when I was coming back, I did like a little bit of asking around at the different studios. Something I heard about here at Orange Tree Fitness Audubon, they have something in their HVAC system that essentially helps like purify the air and kill germs. This is not at every single Orange Tree Fitness studio. This is by the owner's expense, and I believe they only have it at their two studios that they happen to own, which is Audubon and Collegeville. Am I kind of correct on yeah, that? Yeah, I can't speak for other studios, but I know here are our studios and a college row location. We do have HVC up in our havoc system, so any of your airborne pathogens that do go up in the air, it's going to be decentified, disinfected by having that HVC lights built in. So that's another way that we're just working to make sure our members are as safe as possible. CDC guidelines, social distancing, all that mm -hmm. as well. So. Nice. Awesome. And so, yeah, I appreciate that. So I guess you guys will just let me know when this link is in and I'll be here to pick it up. Yep, your email is coming to you right now. We'll Perfect. reach out to you when you have it. Awesome. Sure proudly, you know? Yeah, so I will. Do you have, you don't have it on, do you? No. Oh, I'm like, oh my gosh. But, okay, cool. Well, thank you so much and enjoy the rest of your day, Todd. Thank you. Yeah, what? Okay, 
guys. I just got done with that orange theory workout. Remembered to take my mask off this time before I drive home. When I was on the treadmills, towards the end, we were doing four all outs and I was able to continue to increase. I started with 9.0 and increased by 0.2 each time. So I did 9.0, 9.2, 9.4, 9.6. And then I did bump it all the way up to 10, like in the last little 15 seconds. I did have a side sticker though, but honestly, I was just pushing through. I feel so good starting my day that way, especially on a rainy day. Like the last thing that you want to do is get out of your bed sometimes on a rainy day, especially like if you have like your day off like me. So whether it's a weekend or a PTO day, starting your day with orange cherry, there's just no better way. And also my chart is so good. Actually, I have to stop my watch. God. That's one thing that I miss about wearing my orange tree fitness heart monitor is them emailing me the chart and obviously stopping my watch for me But this is my chart from the free app zones It probably won't be for a couple videos till you see me with the actual orange cherry link I'm so excited for that to click it onto my Apple watch. It's definitely gonna be super interesting I'm so glad that I pre-ordered it as you heard Ty say there's a limited amount at each studio So if your studio is pre-ordering them make sure you place your order because they only have so many to give out Meeting coach Ovi was awesome I actually found out that he used to be the head coach at orange tree Audubon and then he's moved moved around and now he's back at Audubon. So I didn't even know that, but Ty had told me that in the beginning. You'll learn something new every day, people. That concludes today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found it entertaining. I hope you found it helpful. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up because it really supports my channel. Don't forget to subscribe so you never miss another Fitty Freckles video again. Follow me on Instagram and I will see you in my next video.